God had no idea what's going on. You know that. You know there's you know there's STDs. You know there's God loves you. God wants everyone to come. Isn't 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 Bullshit! You want your wife Bullshit! Bullshit! Good answer, good answer. No, no, but... No, but I'm curious. No, I'm curious. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, I'm curious. No, no, no. My friend, I'm curious. Alright, so... Okay, let me give you a simple answer about all of them. No, 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 no. No, 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 I'm curious. No. I know, I'm gonna give you a good answer. I'm not trying to be... No, 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 I'm curious. But but some, there are some answers as far as getting... Drinking and getting to a part where you're no longer sober, where a man has to take account of the spirit of God talking to him. How much is really drinking to where the alcohol is affecting your mind? Okay. And if it affects your mind to where you're not the same person, then you need to watch and be careful. But 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 now, now I can say oh now I can say once you take three beers, you better be very really careful. Man. No okay okay okay. I understand. Look no 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 look. Because would you would you would you want your daughter, an eight-year-old daughter? How much do you want her to drink of alcohol? My eight-year-old daughter. Yeah, yeah. How much would you want her? To how drink? much would you want your eight-year-old daughter? None. Okay, I agree. So I prefer to stay away. No, I but I completely agree. Yeah. I completely agree. But can I? No, we can talk right here. Let's. I'm yeah. moving away because Channel Five News. But I Channel agree Five with News. You about the alcohol, but what about like the sexual pleasures? Well, see, God's God made the sexual pleasures that if you're married, you can enjoy yourself. But outside of marriage. He doesn't want you to commit fornication because if you get an innocent girl and you had to do stuff with her, you become one with her. She takes on your bonding and you take on his bonding and it messes up your life as you move on. Did he tell you that? That's what God said in the Bible, yeah. In the Bible, that you become those one. are if words. You go, if you go to first, first, no, no, those are first words Corinthians of God 6, through other people, right? First Corinthians 6 says that you can't iron through you. First Corinthians 6 says you can't mix salt water and fresh water. Together. That book's thrown you can't out. Mix a lot, though. fellowshipping with the world. Which so you're interpreting it fresh wait, water wait, and salt water. You're, you're interpreting it. No, no, no. It. no, no, no the it's thrown out. You can't out, get an adulterer. You can't get someone that's born no, you. You just told me you can't do it. Corinthians is a burden. I can pull it out right now. You can read it. You just interpreted it. But Corinthians is a burden. You can't interpret it. You can't interpret it. You're interpreting it. So what are you saying? Corinthians is fresh water. You interpret it. I gave you one no, one you part of a it. large verse, dude. You don't read your books that way and study. Curious, you don't just though. read one verse and say, oh, but, you interpreted it. My friend. That's right. Take the content. I don't like Channel 5 either. <laughs> but I'm just saying. It's Channel 10, though. We're back with that. Jack, can you bring that up here? No, no, no. no. Well, why has Corinthians been thrown out? It hasn't. It has. No. It's been thrown out more times. No, it hasn't. Yes, it As a matter of fact, there was simply, it was since AD 70 when it came out, it's always been a part it's of the canon scripture. Uh, you, can, you gotta search those scriptures. I know, I have. So and Corinthians, Corinthians is a book from a person that like people are like, no, no. let's not read this book. No, they, 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 they got together. Now listen, our last apostle was 100 AD, okay? Which one was that? John. The apostle. Are you sure it wasn't me? Yeah. Well, of how? course it isn't you. The how? Do you think you were John the Apostle? I'm, no, I'm not John the Apostle, but you said our last Apostle was John. Yeah. With this An Apostle is a person that, that God has spoken to. Who, who, who read, who, who, who wrote the last book of the Bible, Revelation. Okay, That's what I was talking about. wrote the last book, so what's stopping me from writing a book? You could, and we'll, we'll see if it's inspired or not by God, by what you write. Okay, so how is that possible? So first you'll have to say, the God Holy you Spirit. serve, what kind of by God the Holy is Holy Spirit. It? So if I write a book, the Holy Spirit's going to be like, hey, I just want to tell you, Anthony Cisneros is writing a book in my name. Hey, Anthony. Anthony. No, Is just out of curiosity. Yes, no. My okay, well, let me, let me solve it this way, okay? As we take all the religious books that we already have, all the antiquities that them, we have. All of them, yes, okay? yes. That the are Bible, all words of God through somebody else. Okay, so the Bible has made a distinction. It says... I'm superior to all other religions. Yes, I'm, I'm the Bible. I'm exclusive. A book okay. of God's word through somebody else's interpretation. Okay, let me finish. Okay. Now, these guys that wrote this Bible through people, through people's personalities, it says it was God breathed by God. God wrote through men, through okay. their personality. It has their personality on it still, but he wrote through them. Now, now, if you have a problem with Genesis 1, no, I no, don't. No, I haven't finished. I don't. If you have a problem with Genesis 1, 1, You'll have a problem with the whole Bible. Did you know what Genesis 1-1 says? The beginning God created the heavens and the earth. 
In the beginning, Amen. God created space, time, and matter. He created and, the heavens and the earth. And who says I have a problem with that? Okay, well, I'm just saying, once you can know that, that he created all this, yes. then to think that God can write through men is easy. No, exactly. Right? Okay, okay, so now, now, now no, let's prove the Bible. Can I say, can I say one thing? Okay. Now, you believe that, correct? Well, let me prove that no, it's no, real. No, no, that's no, what the no, question no, that's is. that's fine. You right? believe that, You want to know if the Bible's real? No, I, 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 written I never by said God. that. I never Written said that. God. I never said that. You I, just, I you just told me there's many religious no. books. No, I did not. I never said anything about many religious books. I just okay. said, I said, if I came here and I said, hey, God has spoken through me. Okay. What would keep you from believing that? First, I would do is ask you who your God is, who do you serve, and we begin to go from there. Right? Because you, you could do that. Okay, so we'll start talking about it. Seeing what he's done in your life, as you interpret who you are and what he's told you, just they've done it. Book of Mormon's done it. Oh, well, yeah, done everybody it. has. But they've been known to be falsified in their right How? Because, for instance, archaeology. I don't know if you were here 20 minutes ago. I talked about all this stuff, but no, I didn't. Okay, so archaeology. You can Google this. Go to the Book of Mormon. Archaeology. See how much archaeology. Now it's already since they've been around. It's already been a uh, 900 years. They should have been able to find. So they came out in 1800s. Right? Okay. You should be able to find some kind of archaeology of kings of tongues.